Yeah. Hopefully no upsets weather-wise this week. You know, uh, today's going to be a winner, that's for sure. Uh, after today, I'm not putting any money on this forecast because it is not looking great as the rain is set to return tonight. But as we know, we're now into the first few days of spring. We've got to have some rain mixed with some of that sunshine to give us those nice blooming plants. <laughs> and I, I think that you're probably already starting to see at least the tulips coming up at this point in the season. We have some warmer days ahead, but I'll tell you what, this is going to be the warmest day in the extended forecast. And I believe by far not only the pick of the week, but perhaps the pick of the next couple of weeks. 45 currently with a clear sky right now. We've got the southwest wind around seven miles per hour. That's going to help in combination with a lot of sunshine today and that coming together is going to bring us temperatures that will be about 20 degrees above average this afternoon. We've got 44 next hour, 43 during the 8 o'clock hour, and that's going to be about the coolest that we get through the morning. And then we kick off that warming stretch 10 o'clock in the morning, 51 degrees. We're back to 60 by noon. And then eventually as we get into the peak afternoon heating into the low 70s for highs today, the exception will be Richmond at 68, but everyone else into the 70s this afternoon, 73 in Greencastle. We've got 72 in Columbus and around 74 for Terre Haute and in Bedford. So a nice warm afternoon lies ahead. Same deals we head into the evening tonight. The sun not going to set until just a few minutes before the 8 o'clock hour, and we are still going to be in the upper 60s at that point. Cloud cover will slowly increase as we get into the later evening, but still, we stay mostly clear and dry, 65 degrees at 8 p.m. This is where things change. Going to happen during the overnight. Cloud cover first builds in during the evening. We'll still keep your rain chance around 0% through about midnight, and then basically a wall of showers is going to move in about 4 o'clock in the morning early tomorrow and then your rain chance as we get into tomorrow morning and pretty much through the course of the day going to be at a 100 percent so it will be quite a saturated day tomorrow and as far as our temperatures go we drop back near 50 so not a cool start to the day but then we just really don't warm up all that much because of the rain that's going to be ongoing so here's that latest timeline as we get into the overnight 4 a.m this is when that first round of rain moves in and then it becomes steady through the course of the afternoon widespread showers here as we get into tuesday at 5 p.m and then rain's really not going to go anywhere we've got some heavy rain in fact as we get into our tuesday night and then again on Wednesday as we have essentially an area of low pressure that's going to track right through central Indiana. Going to keep these showers around. This is 7 a.m. on Wednesday. Scattered rain still going to be a possibility into your Wednesday afternoon. And then it just stays somewhat damp as we get into Thursday and Friday as well. As we have kind of the remnants of that weather system still lingering with us. So we'll go 44 much cooler on Thursday. Recovering near 50 with at least a chance of a few showers. And then as we get into this next weekend, much cooler with highs back into the 40s and perhaps even even a mixed shower possible Saturday.